Do we have a quorum? One, two, three. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Only one person there. Yeah. Probably Janice said she couldn't come. Yeah, Janice was. But I'm not sure about Guy's. No, Guy oh, lost oh. a parent in the law. Oh, he lost oh. his father in law. Or yeah. mother in law. Mother in law. Uh, he lost his father. Sorry. Recently, so he wanted to just put it away. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we're, we're so he was uh, coming back from Sacramento and he had his last So maybe Joe, no. move over a little yeah. bit so you yeah, I will. you're that together way I'm out with out us. Move it along. We're getting ready to start, buddy. I think we're all here. I think close the door. Yeah, we. Okay. I'm going to move yeah, more. Yeah. And you'll give me that list of all? Yeah. <coughs> Are we missing a camera person? Yes, yes. we only have two. Oh, okay. I can go do camera. <laughs> <laughs> can I? I'll do Do you, you want a remote? Chair? He does you don't want to do it. No, I'm going to go over there. We can run our own meeting. We should have the robots. <laughs> So my dad used to live next door to um, to that guy. What's his name? Um, Gary Lockwood. Yeah, he was actually his neighbor in in the Oh yeah. Uh, it's like we really people look so much better. It's also. Just get cataract yeah. surgery. It'll be reversed. Then you can't read. Four, three, two, one. We're on. Good evening. I'd like to call to order the meeting of the Community, Tele Community Television of Santa Cruz County Board of Directors of January 27th, 2020. Would the secretary kindly call the roll? Chairman is yours. Here. Director Hall. Here. Director Rand. Here. Director Mantheim. Here. Director O'Driscoll. Director Lanier. Director Svensson. Here. Director Gudger. Here. All right. Thank you very much. So I believe we do have a quorum and we can continue as the board. Um, uh, item number two is oral communications. Is there anybody here who would like to address the board? Seeing none, we can move right along to uh, consideration of late additions to the agenda. Any late additions, deletions? All right, seeing none, we can move right along to the consent agenda, which is items four, five, and six, to approve the minutes of our last meeting of December 2nd, 2019, and to accept the Finance Committee um, recommendations uh, to accept the uh, November and December 2019 financial reports. Um, any questions, comments? Uh, would our I'll uh, move and then we second and uh, have a couple of quick comments. Okay, we have a motion from Director Hall. Uh, is there a second? Second. Second from Director Mannheim. I just want to mm -hmm. thank everybody that was involved in the hiring of the executive director. There's quite a bit of financial transaction the Mel Sweet, our bookkeeper, took, and the committee who really diligently worked on kind of the financing arrangements for this. So uh, this is kind of the end of an era of reports to you and the beginning of another era. So with that, that's all I was going to say. All right, thank you very much. Um, any other comments or questions? Yeah, yes. one quick comment. I noticed in reading about the actions on hiring a full-time executive director that we need to come back into open session, session yes. at some point um, with the exact salary for our new executive director. Okay. So um, I'll be, just a comment that it, when we get to suggestions for the next agenda, I'll be asking if that be done. Oh, okay, very good. All right. Any further else, comments or questions? Uh, I'll make a motion. Uh, we, 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 had a, we had a motion and a second already. Oh, so I'll call the vote. <laughs> All those in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? All right. That carries unanimously. Moving right along uh, to our regular agenda, we have item seven, which is the oral report of the executive director. Dr. Kindly, take it away. All right. <laughs> our full time <laughs> executive director. <laughs> I need to have um, so we'll start uh, as usual with the financials, which is a co-working center. So, so my reports are a month behind. We're reporting on December now, not on January. So the co-working <coughs> center uh, in November, uh, because we didn't um, meet in November, I'm going to give you that number. Uh, we are ninety-one hundred dollars, and we our break-even number is ten. So that was we were a little low that month. But in December we were up over eleven, and we're up over eleven now. 
And we also had miscellaneous income of $11,000. So we're okay. What does that mean? That's a plus. Well, uh, <laughs> we had a uh, insurance claim that was paid and it was $11,000. So that was, we put that into our operating budget. That's a good thing. Um, underpaid services, uh, we did 18 meetings in November and only 11 in December, but that's par for the course. Nobody wants to meet during Christmas. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, we have some scheduled projects, which are um, uh, paid productions, which you see in the budget. It's under the heading of paid productions. We're doing the Calciano lectures in February, which we always do. And we have a new project um, in development. We're working on a, a, another um, nonprofit who wants to do an event, and we're working with them. We'll see if, they, if they're able to do it. But we have a possible other production on the horizon. Yeah. Um, and under equipment and facilities, um, we are working on new signage, and I sent you a picture mm -hmm. so you could see what it would look like when we put new signs on top of the building. And we also want to paint the building a brighter color, and Keith was alarmed. But <laughs> <laughs> I think it w we're so far back from the street, people don't see us with our beige and gray motif. So we thought this bright color, which is one of our colors is green, mm. would um, cause people to see the building. So uh, mm. we're working on that. Um, since we did this nice thing, um, wow. Satellite changed their logo. <laughs> so oh, we really? um, are redoing it. So next month I'll bring you the new version. And uh, the, it, their logo actually is much nicer. Yes. Are we also going to replace the monument sign out front. Yep, 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 yep. Please. Yeah, I have a, I have a, a copy of that too, but I just didn't want to yeah, clutter okay. up your, Good. your report with too many things. Yes, and we're going to, what we're going to do with that is, um, well, we're going to redo what we were going to do. What we had planned was because satellite's logo was an odd shape, and that thing, the little satellite that pops off took up so much space, and then there was a bunch of white space, and it just wasn't a good shape. For the shape of the sign, we decided to um, build a little thing around the bottom of the sign that would make it more of a rectangle and less of a square so that we could that it would look nicer and we could kind of compress it. And now satellite changed our logo, so mm -hmm. we're having to come up with something new. But we will be painting the outside of it green so it won't be gray. So now it just sort of blends in and you don't notice it. So I know, I know. It's like, oh, I, we good. have a designer working on this. We're not like winging it. <laughs> so, so it's going to be pretty. And uh, yeah, we're gonna definitely, it'll have black letters instead of gray, and it'll have a nice new logo, so it'll be, it'll be fancy and fun. Head? Oh, and what you don't see mm -hmm. here is in the black bar where it says, um, it, you can't tell, if you, it, it says Digital Media Studio in that right. black bar. We're gonna put the CTV <coughs> logo in there mm, as well. Okay. Oh, okay. So we have the CTV logo on the front of the building and on the side of the building as well. So it's good timing for that, we think. And since we're doing new signs, it works out great. So we're going to add that. So I didn't have that version with the new logo, so, uh, but you'll get the idea. Um, moving on to equipment, um, we received payment from our insurance company for our, the camera that was stolen. That was the miscellaneous $11,000. And we received a nice donation of equipment and computers from a local filmmaker. And he donates stuff to us every year. And this year he gave us this gigantic computer that's very fast and has tons of really nice software on it. And he's given us, he gave us two in the past. They were um, named Sid and Nancy. This one is named <laughs> Bertha. <laughs> so Big Bertha. <laughs> so we can keep them straight. Mm -hmm. And um, it, very nice. He also gave us a lot of really, like, um, uh, GoPro cameras and uh, like a match set with water housings and all kinds of cool stuff. So and a ton of nice things. And Victor's going through it, figuring out what we can use. And, and Matilda and her team, I, guess, I hope she has a team, will uh, mark it all, <laughs> put it in our... Um, no, I <laughs> if anyone would like to volunteer for Matilda's team. <laughs> well, <laughs> one, one of our camera persons is one, of, one person on oh, my good. team. Good. And I have okay. another person. Well, it's, a, it's, a, it's cool stuff, and it'll be great to get it in there. Not only be good for our, our own members, but it's the kind of thing that um, local people video rent. people will mm -hmm. rent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, so it's really nice. Uh, should we, uh, he may not want to be recognized, but should we put a little... You know, recommendation or a thank you to him. 
Well, I, he's not like um, you. We couldn't hire him. He works on films, so he's not like. No, I just said thank you for oh, us for the. Equipment. Yeah, it's Chris Leahy. Who's oh, okay. a, a local filmmaker. He does a lot of second unit work and yeah. and other things like that. He lives on the. He's over on the west side, and um, every year he does this for us. It's oh, very. So it's really nice. Okay. Yeah. And um, uh, let's see. And he's very kind. He even brings it here for us. And this wow. year, he brought it on a cart, which he let us have the cart, too. <laughs> <laughs> he had the cart. He gave us all these great containers and cases. Wow. And it was just really nice very stuff. Very generous. Uh, under publicity and events, under communication, publicity and events, we, um, it's the holidays, so not, not a lot went on. But we did do some nice things. Ian Barry, who's our community coordinator, held First Friday events, both in Dece December and November. And we also, he also did, um, he collected donations for the food bank. He had a, um, a turkey that he collected uh, money for for Thanksgiving. It was a Target turkey, so it was like looked real. <laughs> and it, was, it was fun. People had a fun time putting their money in the turkey. And then we did a holiday tree for the Salvation Army. So we did two of those. And he also always does Bagel Mondays and Waffle Wednesdays. So anyone who's thinking about working in the co-working center, we feed you. Mm. So um, you get, we have a fun waffle maker. You pour the stuff in the top, a waffle comes out the bottom, and bing bang, Wednesday mm. waffles. No Fresh. Sure. Nutella. Oh, oh yeah. I saw that on the that. board there. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that caught my eye. Yeah. We Nutella have syrup maybe? also and butter. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Cream cheese for the waffles. We don't skimp. <laughs> and uh, Friday is espresso. So, and we're going to do some more, we're working on some more uh, fun things for January. So we're, we're doing more lunch and learns. And we've now got, um, we have a number of doctors working here. So we've put a sign outside. You probably didn't see because you came after five, but we have like an A-frame, a pretty A-frame sign that goes outside to say which doctors are here today because people arrive on the porch and are like, this is not a doctor's office. Mm -hmm. And the doctors are seeing patients, patients here? Literally oh. seeing patients here? Yes, but they're, well, they're like psychologists. Oh, they're okay. Not, okay. Yeah, they do testing and mm -hmm. things like that. Okay. They're not, not, I mean, testing, you know, of the mind, okay. not okay. the body. Okay. So, so yeah. no, no minor surgeries yeah. are happening <laughs> in the <laughs> cafe? Well, we, don't, we don't like to speak of that. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, so, so that was a great thing that Ian did. And he had, I arrived this morning, there it was outside with the doctor's names on it, their office numbers. It was great. So um, we're uh, moving right along under outreach. Um, we did, uh, I did communicate in December with the Cabrillo College Di Digital Media Program, and I'm going to speak there at some point this year. So um, we're working on getting interns, and we have, um, we have uh, jobs posted on a few intern internet places. And uh, so um, we're excited about that. And that is kind of a slow month, December. So that's my report for December. All right. Thank you very much. Are there any questions, comments from the board? All right. Seeing none, we can move right along. We might actually break the land speed record today. <laughs> um, so uh, item number eight is the oral report from the Volunteer Advisory Committee Chair, which is now Director Gudger. Keith? So not a lot going on with the holidays, but a couple of things to report. There's going to be a, a shop talk for producers and directors Looks like it's going to be February 16th, and we're hoping Becca will talk to the producers and directors about best practices for uh, producing video. And the other thing is, is at Becca's urging, we're setting up a candidate statement day, and I believe, let me check, it's February 7th, is that? Yeah, mm -hmm. February 7th. Yes, February 7th, from, from 10, 10 to 4. 4. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And e anyone who's on the local ballot in this county. I'm trying to invite them all. I've invited most of them, but not all yet. Can come and in 15 minutes, they'll get a chance to make a two minute statement. And then Becca's gonna have staff edit it together and it'll run on our channels. Fantastic. Does that include issues as well as candidates? So far it's just candidates. candidates. Um, I was yeah. We weren't talking about doing issues. Mm -hmm. I yeah, didn't notice today there are issues on the ballot. Yeah. <laughs> yes, there are. No, but we're just doing candidates. Mm. Okay. May I say one more thing? Yes, please. Um, we're also, uh, the s Victor and his staff are putting together a bunch of messages about voting. So uh, we, we're doing three, one where to register to vote, one the day you're supposed to vote, because sometimes the wrong dates go out. Mm -hmm. So we want to make sure people know what day it really is. And uh, 
uh, the number to call so that you can find out where your polling place is. Mm -hmm. So it's a website also, I think. That and yeah, 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 yeah website yeah. links yeah. and and uh, phone numbers. And then last year we had two people come and. Yeah, we'll repeat those. Okay. Yeah, we're going to repeat those as well. If they're still. They're if they're well. The dates different. <laughs> the mm -hmm. dates are different, but they talked kind of generally about. Yes. about voting yeah so they probably it's sort of when we did it, it was sort of a generic they thing. actually thought that they want to do it again it's now that they've gone through it <laughs> <the books, laughs> they want to do i think do it again ah, well, but they may do it for november it's up to you guys well the thing is uh, i mean we yeah, kind of november. agreed that you yeah, know, we have time. but maybe for november we should yeah. do new ones yeah yeah not a bad idea <coughs> And we can use this, these packages that we're making. We can just then change the date of the election going forward. So yeah. we'll have this really nice motion graphic package for a long time yeah. going yeah. forward. Oh, wonderful. That's, that's it. Is there, uh, nothing to add? OK, that sounds good. Um, well, we can move on to item number 9N, which is my oral report, board okay. chair. And uh, I, once again, don't have much to add. It's the holidays. I, I finally did send an email uh, to county regarding uh, and I think the timing is bad. I think that right now they're gearing up for the March 3rd election, and so mm -hmm. I, I have not heard back uh, regarding, you know, tying in with the uh, county elections department. But I'm glad to hear that uh, we're moving forward with getting candidate statements, uh, um, which will air on community television. But uh, yeah. um, at some point, it would be nice to uh, talk to the, uh, the elections department and see if we can actually um, tie in with them. Um, yeah, they've been pretty swamped, a lot of activity. Um, I will say that if you're uh, near the county building, if you stop by the second floor, uh, or the third floor, where Elections is, um, there's quite a nice, they put in a bunch of beautiful artwork that's election related. Mm -hmm. related mm -hmm. And um, I saw the announcement about that. Yeah, yeah. nice. Uh, they're having some technical difficulties with the, there's a, like a history of voting and, and women's voting rights and such, but uh, it's all magnetic and so pieces keep falling down and such, but, <laughs> but it's, a beautiful, it's a beautiful design. Um, well, don't worry, women still have the right to vote. Yeah. <laughs> Thank goodness. Yes. Um, so uh, that's about it for me. So um, I guess we can move on to item 10, which I believe we had a... a Board member who had a request for an item to appear back. Two right. of us. Just, just a okay. um, follow up on. Um, we need to come back and re um, vote on and or report out. I'm not sure which. Uh, maybe our Larry brand Agno, expert, Larry. Would I that believe we have to vote. Vote. Okay. Yeah. So yeah. we vote on our executive director salary. Okay. And then there are a couple of things from the finance committee. One, we should put on here mid-year budget adjustment because we have a few things. We have one, we know the software for services category needs to go up a little. It's a little more costly. It's not major things, but I'll leave it general so if things come up with Mel's work. Yeah, there is one other thing, but I can't remember what it is right now. Well, that's why we things. just put yeah. in your budget adjustment. And the other one, uh, if this gentleman has been giving us all this equipment, we should put an item on and officially thank him. Okay. And yeah, I didn't know if he wanted it public or not, but I mean, I was well, we need to we need to also accept it. Oh, okay. Well, we need to officially accept it, and then that means that he, you know, he can get the right off. Yeah. Uh -huh. Well, we did accept it, and we've sent him a letter. Yeah, I just thought publicly. Yeah, but I mean the the board. I think. I mean, I think it's a nice gesture. Yeah. Okay. I mean, he, he's been doing it. He said for years. So yeah. I, mean, I thought Jesus. for as long as I've been here, he's been doing yeah. it. Yeah. Well, that's a long. Anyhow. Yeah. That was my two things. Okay. I'll be happy to add those. Happy to add those items to the next agenda. I just have to make sure I uh, leave a reminder for myself. <laughs> um, so, uh, any further no items, one? requests? No. no. All right, then we can move on to item 11, which is announcements. Um, uh, uh, always like to take this opportunity to thank our volunteer crew, um, diehard uh, community TV members. Um, and today we have in the studio Richard Dussel, Sherry Ross. John James, Linda Janakis, and Karen Scott. Thank you all very much. For I would change the word to committed. Committed. <laughs> what, did, what did I say? Diehards. Diehards. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> committed. Committed. Yes. Um, um, so, uh, any further announcements? None. Okay. None. Then I'll. I entertain a motion, motion for adjournment. Item number twelve. I know. We have a motion. For, uh, uh, Vice Chair Rand. Nobody a wants to second. Dr. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Svensson, second. All those in favor? Aye. Any opposed? Aye. All right, we're adjourned, and it's 517. I'm going to note that. <laughs> <laughs>